Hello everybody, I hope that you are doing very well and welcome back to another cryptocurrency technical analysis where in today's video I'm going to be going over the Bitcoin chart here, the range that we have just broken out of and how this is likely to trade in the near future. So I hope that you thoroughly enjoy this video, very much spontaneous and unplanned and uh, you can thank El Capitan for uh, this video. Uh, because yeah, I wasn't actually planning to do it. I'm just on the one minute time frame sculpting to be honest uh, And you know, I had a really nice friendly comment from somebody asking for a video uh, help is needed So hopefully this is video a uh, this is a video that is helpful for you and many others So yeah, thank you for the nice comment and more than happy to bring it when I have some nice feedback like this So um, yeah, let's begin with Bitcoin. I want to start on the higher term time frame You can see we're getting a bit of a bearish uh, retest of the channel, but let's cover that in a second Okay, uh, since the last video, I think the last video that I made, we must have been at around 8,900, okay? Uh, so we've obviously had a bit of action from then, okay? So from really interesting, the level that we got rejected off of, this was the level that I was waiting for for a long time, 9,150. Obviously, our big monthly level, this was a big, big, big resistance level. And uh, in the end, yeah, we obviously come up to that resistance, didn't get a close through. You then had some more action on the lower term time frame before, obviously, that break to the downside. Um, you know, but that's so that's how we got to this in, uh, initial range, you know, all coming off of that high term time frame monthly level. So we have obviously clearly rejected from that now. You know, we've come down from that level, 9,150, come down and we form this range, okay, for nearly three, four days we were inside of this range, okay. Okay, and from within inside this range, uh, you know, I didn't actually take many trades at all. Okay, I think I took about three trades within the range because I, I just felt it was not a great trading environment. Uh, because on, you know, half of me was, um, you know, really wanting to take a swing fire pattern long of the lows. The other half of me was wanting to wait for eight thousand nine hundred ish to take a short. And I wasn't really comfortable trading within this range, and that's because I felt there was really uh, strong um, technical analysis for longs and also really strong technical analysis for shorts. And when it's so even and the case is, you know, the case for a long or short is so close, I prefer to just take a little step back and not actually try and actively trade it. Okay, so I didn't really trade too much in here. Okay, my next trade was on oh, no, the trade that I've taken today. I actually did take a long from the from the what I was hoping for would be a swing throw pattern of the lows before I move up, and I did mention this on uh, Twitter. You know, I'm more 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 than happy to, uh, you know, unlike 99% of Twitter that will never tell you that they take a loss. You know, I'm more than happy to tell you, tell you that I take losses, and it's you know it's part of trading. I'm not ever going to go on 100% not lose a trade, so that would be crazy. So. This was actually a trade that I, you know, showed you all this morning when I was in a bit of a loss, uh, looking to trade that support resistance. Um, well, basically trade a swing failure pattern of the lows, which never came. Uh, but I'll show you what, what, how it like manifested, okay, into a pretty nice trade in the end. But uh, you know, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that, that's just part of technical analysis, I suppose. In the end, I managed to get out with a bit of a win, but nevertheless, you know. Uh, what we have here is is two Gartley harmonics in a row. Okay, so you might think this is uh, this is where we, we got from the uh, from the comment, by the way. So it's, I'm happy I put this out on Twitter. But uh, yeah, so what we have here, okay, is obviously this is our first Gartley comes up, hits take profit one, not take profit two before coming back down again. Obviously, you're getting your X, and then you get. I mean, there's tr there's even trades within trades. You can see here six one eight six one eight seven eight six six one eight six one eight seven eight six, uh, and this one actually goes on to hit take profit one, and take profit two is the one to one of X to A. Okay, so actually in the end, what I thought might have been a losing trade ended up being you know being a bit of a winning trade, and uh, we did get then the move back down. So I am actually in a short position right now, but again, this is really low term time frame sort of trades. Okay, like the entry entry triggers. Okay, so what I saw this was, you know, obviously a rejection from the channel, come back down uh, 12 o'clock exactly. So you can see on this candle here, you form a, new, form a new four hour candle on our new four hour candle. What we've done here, okay, if I just hide the sculpts a second. So what we've done is we actually come back and be back tested that range. Okay, so we've back tested these support, support, support as a resistance. Essentially, you can even see there. Looking at this now, you can see a really nice last four hour. You know the, two, you know what would be eight hours ago to where you are now. There's even an SR flip on that level, okay. And then when we come down to the one, one back to the one minute chart, it was also a stop run of the last high, okay. So we also stopped run the last high. So I must must say that um, on the short, you know, I'm in a short position right now, uh, but you know it's not necessarily all doom and gloom. I must say that on the higher term time frame perspective, I, I am actually still, you know, do have a more of a bullish bias. Oh, by the way, I'm, I am in ENG. I am in ENG. Uh, that was given in a trading update today in the group, and that's currently flying. So that is nice to see, up 10%. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, getting a bit distracted. Didn't notice that. That's literally moving up as we're speaking, so that's brilliant. 
Um, but yeah, what I wanted to say is, you know, currently in a short, but on the bigger term time frame, I still am looking at this more bullishly, if I'm honest. OK, so uh, what I would like to see to close out of my short, OK, and, and come back into a long is it is really a, a reclaim back into this. So this level, so you're talking 8,500, come back and claim that. OK, or alternatively, OK, alternatively, would like to see, obviously, we have a monthly support 8,300. But you're getting big support at 8,220, 8, uh, down to like the 8,000 psychological level. Weekly sat at 8, 7,800, okay? Uh, what would be pretty interesting is, is you do you do have the possibility of, um, where was it that I was looking at? So this sort of like trend line, and here you have a left shoulder, here you have a head, and we could form like the right shoulder here before it takes off really bigly. But that's, you know, I'm not really, I don't trade off such high term time frame patterns. If I'm honest, like I'm more down on the lower term time frame at the moment, at the moment, at the moment. But, you know, the, it could be, this could be like a really nice bottoming pattern that we've formed here, and now we've just had our impulse up. So uh, I must say that, you know, short term, I am in a, in a short, obviously, but I am looking to, close out of this in the near term and flip back into the longs because I do feel the bigger picture for me um you know obviously I'm really aware of the level that we came off of so you know that that's 8000 9150 you know it wasn't just the um wasn't just the fact that we were um at that monthly level we were also at the 618 resistance so you know when you know debating this you 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 had the confluence of factors here okay so it wasn't just one level that you were up against so you know i'm very much aware okay very much aware that we were at this resistance you know and that's why i took profits on it but uh you know at, since then we've obviously come down so i'm in a short position but i am looking to flip long and uh you know for, for me the long trigger would be a you know i'd, I'd really like to see the eight you know eight two hundred eight thousand touch but um if we reclaim back into this range then obviously i'll trade it back to the top of the range um so i do hope that this video has made sense to you i really 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 do and i hope that it has been helpful for you um yeah, this was like sculpt trading, obviously, but this was like saying, you know, anyone that says you cannot trade on the one minute chart, you know, you could have actually had on this trade, this one minute chart alone, there was one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven trades uh, in a, in like a few hours in the morning. That's a lot of trades. Uh, <laughs> so the one minute chart, and this is all really, really technical, like levels being respected to the dollar, 618 to the, you know, you know, you can see you're definitely not getting stopped on these trades. So like, you know, the TA is definitely there even not down on the one minute and you know, that's a brilliant example for you all um and if you're interested like this is what we're doing all, all the time <laughs> in the group chat so you can see the really good ta that's coming in here like really good ta that was me saying about the take profit two hit uh of, of that sculpt long uh and then obviously you know this guy spot in here like a, a bearish abcd and that obviously did come down again and hit target so you know you, we've got a lot of ta going on in here so if you like that sort of stuff then feel free but yeah Hope that this has been helpful for you. Um, and I will, yeah, catch you in the next technical analysis video I do. Uh, we'll have to see if we get this retraced down to some of those key supports. Because at the moment, you know, it's it's more bearish losing this range. But uh, yeah, higher term time frame, you know, bigger term picture. I'm still looking for a retracement to buy. Uh, so I hope that you thoroughly enjoyed this one. Thank you once again. And... Hello, just a really quick 30 second add on to the end of this video. Uh, firstly, yes, the short's still going well. <laughs> but what I want to highlight to you all is I was just about to reply to El Capitan saying, uh, you know, here's the video, mate. I hope that you thoroughly enjoy it. It's helpful. And I realized that there's another scammer that's created a email address. You know, this is obviously fake. This guy has zero followers. It's just look made it look like it's me. OK, so if I show you, you know, they've, they've got everything exactly the same as what I would have. But obviously it's clearly fake. Um, so yeah, just be careful, please, of these scammers. Um, you know, I literally have a lot of people following me now that are fully haters, okay? So I have people making up rumors about me. I have threats happening. I now have people scamming. Uh, you know, just everything about this at the moment is just so toxic if i'm honest but you just have to be really careful, please. All I'm trying to do is help um, and you don't want to you know you don't want to get involved in, in any of these scams so you know obviously if you're interested in joining you get just go to the website chartchampions.com which is fully safe but you know just be very careful one of the people on twitter because this is clearly not real i mean chat champions i mean come on it's, it's not even close but um yeah there's that <laughs> and uh yeah this was uh this was a really nice comment that you can pause and read this i'm just showing you that some of the actual really really hard working members here are are doing very very well i love that by the way but um yeah, 
yeah, there's that. I just wanted to bring that to attention. Please be careful to scammers. Um, yeah, it's just crazy at the moment. But uh, yeah, <laughs> with that said, this short's still going well. Um, making money. That's all I care about. Cheers. Thanks. Bye. <laughs>